Hello, this is a short tutorial showing how to install the Readlang web reader on iOS Safari. So if you are on Readlang and go to the web reader page, um, which you can get to from the bottom here, web reader extension and bookmarklet, um, then click this install on iOS Safari button. Now you'll be shown this page, which has got some code here. Uh, if you keep your finger on part of the code and copy it, um, the, sometimes you'll you'll tap it and it won't select the whole thing. But in my case, it's selecting the whole thing already, so I'll copy it. Uh, earlier, I found that I had to drag. Yeah, yeah, this is what happened earlier. So I had to drag to encompass all the text. Then I click uh, tap, sorry, let me do that again. Then I tap copy. Then I click this button, the kind of share icon at the top. Uh, and then I tap add bookmark. And I give it a name. So I'll delete the current name here and I'll call it readlang web reader and save. And now it will have placed it here in my bookmarks within favorites. So at the bottom, you can see the Relang web reader. Now I need to edit it. So I'll press the edit button there, then tap on Relang web reader. And now it'll let me edit the URL, the address. And instead of an address to a web page, what goes here is some code that we copied earlier. So I'll keep my finger held on um, the field, let go, and then it'll offer me a paste option, which I'll tap. So now that's pasted all the code in there. I tap done. That's added it to my favorites with the correct address. Now what, I'll get rid of, um, no, I'll leave, I'll leave the favorites up there for now. Done, and navigate to some page that I want to read. Let's go to the Spanish. Wikipedia, and just choose an article that I want to read, uh, Arte Publico de Barcelona. Um, now all I need to do is tap the Readline Web Reader, which is in my, my favorites here, Readline Web Reader. And then you see the Readline toolbar um, appears at the top. It's telling me it's a very large page, which may make this slow down a bit, but I'll carry on anyway. Uh, close that. And now I can tap on any word and it'll translate to English. I can drag across a phrase, uh, la cultura como, culture as, um, arte publico is public art. And there we go. I can enjoy reading this article. And anything that I don't understand, I can easily translate to English. And later on, I can go back to Readlang by tapping here and practice the words that I've just translated. So there you go. I hope that helps.